mate. Not the best performance, but a win in the end. What was your what were your thoughts on the game? Uh, look, not been another arm draw. Uh, thankfully, we got the uh, break at the end, but uh, that's the old cliche. But there you go. Uh, yeah, yeah. So on the whole. Good we got three points and then uh, I can, uh, at least I can uh, enjoy the Easter eggs on Sunday. Yeah, I thought, thought they kept going, kept plodding away and just getting the ball in the box and I think that's all we needed today was just to just get some kind of a win, wouldn't it? Yeah. Just, you know, it's not a great display but a couple of last minute goals so yeah, it's, uh, it keeps it a little bit exciting for someone to play for. Yeah, yeah. And what have you, you know, your overall thoughts been lately? And what's your overall thoughts? You know, anyone stand out today or anyone sort of disappoint you today? Reach had a good game today. I thought Play up some back on. Carol again. Carol Just, you know, getting, getting in there. You think he's old being through and through? Yeah, yeah. I guess he is for them. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, um, we were wondering whether Blackpool might have actually nicked the winner, uh, but thankfully we did. Um, I mean, all credit to Blackpool. They came here, you know, they defended really resiliently, um, and yeah, they basically they had every man behind the ball when we had possession, and we just couldn't find a way through. Luckily, um, <laughs> luckily Andy Carroll managed to get the breakthrough just before half time, but yeah, we uh, started to drop our heads a little bit, let them back into the game, and it was a little bit of a nerve finish you know as I said I thought Blackpool might nick it but thankfully we did. Andy Carroll got another goal today um, what was your, did you think of his performance and would you like to see him get another contract in the summer? Andy yes to the contract yeah so yeah, overall yeah for like a seven or eight seven or eight out of ten yeah so I'd uh, say uh, so shame some of the other forwards couldn't uh, equal his effort and all round play but uh, be nice if we could get a, a younger striker in with him that could uh, maybe work a little bit better. Yeah. Yeah. Tracked in the summer? Definitely, definitely. Because um, when, when, he, when he was playing for Reading, I, uh, no, I he, he didn't seem to be the Andy Carroll that I knew. But yeah, I used to play for Newcastle and Liverpool, so. Yeah. England, and England as well so yeah it was uh, really good to see him on the score sheet again hopefully he can get a new contract and yeah be like the uh, so-called talisman in our promotion push next season yeah and just finally uh, Steve Bruce has said there's gonna be quite a few players leaving this summer is there anyone in particular that you'd like to see depart the Hawthorns this summer um, yeah. no, not big <laughs> Uh, yeah, there's, there is a few, I must admit, but uh, uh, probably, I mean, all the long ones will go. Um, but I think Robinson will have to go. It's uh, another lacklustre performance today. Uh, apart from that, that's a bad I think. And just finally, you know, Bruce has said there's going to be a, an overhaul with the squad, you know, just a couple of players you'd, you'd like to see sort of out the exit door, like to leave this summer. To leave? Yeah. yeah. Probably a few. Quite a few, yeah. Can't, can't get it down to a few. Yeah. If they get a new mortgage and move close to the ground, apparently they'll, they'll stay in. <laughs> well, I've been hearing Sam Johnston is on his way out. He obviously wasn't featured tonight. Um, he's been linked with United and Tottenham. Um, but um, another one, I think, might be Callum Robinson, I'm afraid. As much as I respect him, you know, and... <laughs> and the season that he had, um, like our last promotion season, um, like the scenes on the last day, you know, but he was a bit, you know, flat footed um, today, a couple of uh, wayward passes, not getting into space, so maybe Callum Robinson yeah. will be another one. Who would you like to see leave, Pam? Um, <laughs> Well, that, that would be a tough one for me because it's a question of who can you get in, yeah. you know, to replace them. So, I mean, it's, it, it, is, it is a difficult one to find out what the uh, worst players are in a pretty poor team um, over the course of the season. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's a really difficult one. But as I said, you know, Johnston may be definitely out the door and um, Callum Robinson as well.